Metallica is set to play with Long Long at the 56th Annual Grammy Awards, and they rehearsed their collaboration of Metallica's one earlier this week. The performance is one of many collaborations set for tomorrow's show airing on CBS TV. Lars Ulrich said backstage at rehearsals that it's been a long time since Metallica last graced the Grammys. Well, it's been um, 22 years, I do believe. Um, so we're very excited to be back. Um, that's a long time to be away from anything. Uh, so we've got a lot of uh, energy stored up <laughs> that we're ready to unleash. And um, obviously uh, the Grammys are mostly about mashups. And so we're doing a very cool one with um, our new best friend, which is the Chinese super well, world, worldwide renowned uh, pianist uh, Lang Lang. He talked about the interplay between them and China's biggest musical export, Lang Lang. Well, I would like to think that, you know, on a, on a broader scale that, you know, music is, is music. We, we have a tendency in Metallica to not look much beyond that in terms of definitions, but obviously he's a very, um, he's a very talented musician. He's a very um, dynamic musician. He's a very uh, sort of, um, he, he sort of projects himself very well. He's, I mean, he's, when he plays, he's really full of energy and he's got a lot of kind of showmanship and, and kind of energy that really sort of protrudes off the stage and, and right into people's uh, hearts and souls. So I, I, I would like to think that it's, it's a good collaboration. We did um, you know, a record in 1999, I do believe it was a project we did with uh, the San Francisco Symphony that we made a record and a movie out of. And so we've sort of uh, danced around in the classical world a little bit and uh, it's fun to be back. He then talked about the impact of the Grammys. Well, the Grammys are sort of like the Oscars of the, of the, of the music world, obviously. It's, it's the one full of history and it's the, the most prestigious. Um, and obviously it's where you just get this whole melting pot of different peoples from different genres and everybody just coming together with, you know, the, the sort of sole purpose of spreading the message of music. This is our night to shine. And, and show the world, uh, you know, what music is and what it means to people, you know. Metallica is not the only heavy artist slated for the telecast. Usually with rock relegated to the pre-telecast, this year a finale featuring Dave Grohl, Queens of the Stone Age, Nine Inch Nails, and Fleetwood Mac's Lindsey Buckingham is on tap. Metallica's Through the Never music from the motion picture is up for best recording package at this year's ceremony. Yeah.